Hey guys, so today we'll be talking about top six podcasts based around psychology that I absolutely love and highly, highly recommend you to check out as well because they're sharing a lot of interesting information about our human mind. I mean, podcasts are a great distraction or escape, you know, when you're driving to work or going for a little walk with your dog and definitely can be super interesting and entertaining depending what you're looking for that day. So the podcast we're going to talk about today will hopefully help you to explore our human mind a little bit more and provide you with some motivation and inspiration as we'll be looking into both social psychology, general psychology and also neuropsychology for any students out there or anyone who's interested in psychology and maybe a bit of science here and there. Okay, so let's start with the first podcast, which is called TED Talks. I mean, this one probably doesn't need much introduction, but for those who are yet to discover them, uh, I'll say that TED Talks are essentially self-organized events, uh, talks that engage the audience in deep discussions about absolutely anything and everything. So the reason why I felt like including them on here is because you can find absolutely mind-blowing discussions about various psychological topics, be it neuropsychology, general psychology, or just general well-being discussions. For example, one of my personal favorites, which actually led me to writing my dissertation during my psychology degree, is called The Most Important Lesson from 83,000 Brain Scans. You can find this amazing talk here on YouTube, and it's just a really thought-provoking discussion at how we approach treating mental health illnesses and whether it needs to be challenged at all. I can guarantee you will not regret listening to this episode. And the second podcast I would like to recommend you is called The School of Greatness. So on this podcast, you will find inspiring interviews from the most successful people on this planet, such as leaders in business, entertainment, sports, science, health, literature, you name it. It is extremely informative and entertaining and basically aimed to inspire you and motivate you to unlock your own potentials. For example, they talk about how to reduce stress and anxiety, reprogram your mindset, or even burning body fat if you are interested in fitness. Again, highly recommend to give it a listen when you can. The next podcast we're going to talk about is called All in the Mind. This podcast explores various health conditions and just general well-being problems essentially exploring potentials of human mind. On here, they invite uh, guests who are maybe suffering from certain conditions, and they also invite people who are experts in those fields, and together they're trying to understand the problem someone might be experiencing in much more depth, whilst also discussing any new research relevant to their topics. This podcast also covers more everyday problems that we can all experience from time to time, such as being a night owl or lark, stress, especially at work. There are a few episodes discussing stress levels in junior lawyers and doctors, for example. So in these episodes, they are talking about what stress is, what you shouldn't ignore and why you shouldn't ignore certain warning signs of stress as it can basically lead to a full-blown burnout which is yeah not a fun place to find yourself in also for junior doctor interview they are actually interviewing an ex-junior doctor called adam k who if you're not familiar with um, is actually now a brilliant comedian with a somewhat dark witty and sarcastic sense of humor who also wrote an absolutely hilarious slash sad at times book uh, about his experiences as a junior doctor which is essentially a collection of very funny short stories from his life as a junior doctor the book reflects on various parts of healthcare that can be quite stressful at times He also actually has another book called It Was a Night Shift Before Christmas. That is also a collection of short, hilarious stories before and during his Christmas shift in hospital. So yeah, the interview with him is definitely not going to be boring. Okay, so let's move on to another great podcast called The Psych Files. 
So this podcast explains why we do what we do. For example, it explores why do so many of us fall for conspiracy theories or why do so many of us suffer from insomnia or just struggling to get enough sleep. The guest for this particular episode, Dr. Shelby Harris, will also provide you some useful tips to help you get a better night's sleep by applying cognitive behavioral therapy tactics, such as what to do if you keep having the same thought racing through your mind, preventing you from falling asleep. If you find yourself having trouble falling asleep, you might want to check it out. There is plenty of other useful information you'll find on this podcast as well. Another amazing podcast from this list is called The Psychology Podcast with Scott Barry Kaufman. And this podcast is great if you want to explore how important is psychology in our everyday lives. It covers a range of topics such as neuropsychology behind intelligence or psychology behind bad leadership versus good leadership, which I personally found quite insightful and a lot of the insights can definitely be applied in general social interactions, such as being more self-aware through understanding how you make other people feel. Overall, it is a very light-hearted podcast with very useful and interesting information about a human mind. Okay, so now let's move on to our last podcast today, which is the Brain Science Podcast. This is a very interesting podcast from a more scientific point of view, as it explores how recent discoveries slash research in neuroscience helps us to understand the human brain on a much deeper level. For example, in one of their most recent episodes, they're discussing cognitive dissonance and decision-making such as how our brain recognizes a feeling of knowing. Dr. Ginger Campbell, the host, reads an extract from her book to explain the processes behind this feeling, as well as covering such topics as why our memory can be deceiving and why does it feel good to be right? To answer these questions, the host either interviews expert neuroscientists or other experts in these fields. Overall, it's a very informative podcast, especially for those who are interested in neuroscience or neuropsychology. So that is it for today, guys. However, if you know any other podcasts that are also relevant to psychology or general well-being that you love, please leave a comment down below as I would love to check them out and also share it with you guys. Thank you for watching as always and I will see you soon in the next video.